Hi friends, welcome to Sada Learning Hub. You are with me, Shada Shirao. Today's session, we are going to learn how to connect MySQL database by using JDBC Typo driver. See here, the Typo driver is a 100% pure Java driver. In a Typo driver, a pure Java based driver communications directly with the vendor database through socket connections. This is the highest performance driver available in the database and it is usually provided by the vendor itself. The kind of driver is extremely flexible. You don't need to install a special software on the client or server. Further, these drivers can be downloaded dynamically. MySQL, for example, MySQL connector for J driver is a type 4 driver because of the Propriety nature of their network, protocols, database vendors usually supply for the type 4 drivers. Now, here this type 4 driver is a pure Java driver. It means that the driver is software is 100% implemented in the Java programming language. We call this type 4 driver is a portable driver because it is a platform independent driver. This typo driver uses a native protocol accepting by the server to connect with the database servers. A Java type 4, a Java programmer, we need to supply a following three informations to in the URL of the JDBC driver: IP address, port number, database name, or service ID. If you want to, if you are using a MySQL driver, for example, we need to pass URL JDBC colon MySQL colon double slash localhost double three zero six slash test. Here, test is the database name. Now I can show how it is practically works. See here, I am creating a one class by using the by accessing the MySQL using JDBC type four driver. In this, I am creating a one class. This is test my database. Now, here I am creating a JDBC driver class name. After that, I am creating a database URL. In this database URL, this is the database source and this is the local host and this is the port number. MySQL is running. I am creating a database name called Sada database name. After that, I am giving the username and password. Now, we need to write a JDBC program. We need to do some basic steps. First, we need to load the class, uh, load the driver class name. After that, need to create a connection object. After that, we need to create the statement object or prepare statement object or a callable statement object. After that, we need to execute that statement uh, or prepare statement or callable statement. After that, it returns the sum result. We need to finally close all the connections. If it is the best programming practice for the JDBC. Now I am I am loading the driver class. For that, I am using class dot for name. It loads the JDBC driver. After that, I am creating a connection by using the connection uh, driver manager dot get connection. It takes the database URL, username, and password. After that, I am creating a statement object by using the connection reference con dot create statement. Now I am creating a one query. I am getting all the information available in the employee table. After that, I am executing that query. It returns the result set. I am iterating the result set. It displays the result set on the console. After that, I am closed the, all the resources. What are the I am opened in earlier. Now, see, I am running this program. It can show output like this. If you see here, I am connecting to the database and uh, connection successfully created. After that, create the statement object. Now, in the database, these three, these two records are available in the employee EMP table. I can show. Root. Use. Sada database. Now select star from EMP. See here in this database only two rows are available. The first row is Sada Learning Hub and second row is 
2 and sada this is the way to connect mysql by using the type 4 driver thank you so much watching this video hope this lesson helpful to you keep watching our lessons keep writing to us do not forget subscribe our channel Sada Learning Hub because we have many sessions that would help you to develop our skills and I will be back soon till then you take care bye bye.